Welcome to Ultimate Report. I'm Mary Winkin Werder. Fashion Week is being celebrated, revealing the newest designs and garments for men and women worldwide. We're meeting with Viviano Sue, whose collection is showing at Vancouver Fashion Week for the spring summer 2016 season. Viviano Sue, it's great to have you here. Hey guys, I'm Viviano Sue. Glad to see you. All right. Well, it's, it's wonderful to have you join us. This is very exciting. So how is this collection unique from other collections that you have created? Uh, this time is the first time I'm doing ready to wear. Wow. It's a new fee. So I never try to like product things. So there's new, a lot of new stuff, new things I have tried. It was fun. That's wonderful. So what was the inspiration behind the creation of this collection? Um, it's because this time is the first time I'm doing ready to wear. So I choose this concept, which is just the capital become the butterfly called many Murphysis. That's the theme of this collection. And um, I build all the collection around this in like inspiration. So also I choose only one color. I only use white. Wow. To do all the collection. Because for me, white is the beginning of everything. It's the purest yeah. in the world. So I think that is the things I'm doing this time. That's beautiful. That's I like that. That's very poetic. So Thanks. what were the fabrics that you used to create this collection? And did you use any or did you create any of the fabrics yourself? I do my own print every year. Um, this time I do a flower print. It looks like flower, but if you see really deep, it's actually it's an animal bones and clapped it together. You can see the website. Um, like another things, all the fabric is made in Japan because my brand is based in Japan. I choose a lot. For me, I'm always about mixing textures or something. So you can see some fabric looks like a cocoon and some texture looks like butterflies' wings. It's all about the combination of the different fabric mixing together. That's kind of style I'm doing. That's amazing. So let's talk about the hair and makeup finishing touches. What did you choose to to finish off each one of these unique looks? Okay, uh, for the makeup, this time my model doesn't have any makeup. Wow. Because everyone was wearing this face mask. If you guys can see the runway video in the internet or something, uh, I was starting on this one butterfly in the middle of the mask and in the end of the runway and the last model have all butterfly cover her face. She badly can work. So I was telling her, honey, work really slow. Don't trip. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> oh, and like, they all have this like Japanese kind, you know, hairstyle, have the like sink bowl here, like samurai. And I tie the like face mask in the back. So just go see the, see the video. You guys will like it. It's so different. And that's the thing I'm doing. I don't like be, you know, the same with other people. I want to do something different, and I like to shock people in the wrong way. Absolutely. So uh, entertain them as well, obviously. <laughs> so where can we learn more about Viviano Sue Fashion? Um, you can go to my homepage, which is vivianosu.com. You can go to my Instagram, follow Viviano Sue in Instagram, and my homepage is House of Viviano Sue. It's in my Facebook. You can like my Facebook page. I post it all the time. I post, the, you know, the uh, how I create things, where I go, who I meet. So if you want to learn more about my brand, just go to vivianasu.com and Facebook House of Vivianasu. That sounds great. Well, thanks so much for joining us. It's been wonderful visiting with you. Thank you. Thank you so much. You have a great day. You as well. Catch up with me on my blog, www.beautybeautereport.com, on Twitter at Beauty Publicist, and of course on YouTube, Ultimate Report. Everyone, thanks so much for joining us on Ultimate Report. Have a beautiful and successful week. Mwah. Hmm.